Welcome back. It's Wednesday, so it means your eye on health with Dr. Sadiq Bose, Medical Center Hospital. Doctor, thank you for coming in today. Now, we're talking about, we got a question submitted to us about a fungus on your foot that is kind of a pain. Tell us about that. There is a fungus <laughs> among us, Robert. And um, <laughs> I think it's great that people out there are submitting questions, yeah. whether it's on the CBS or on that's my Facebook page. We're, that's why we're here, to help you guys. So if you have a health question, keep submitting. Um, so we have a fungus among us, and that is the cause of athlete's foot, is actually a fungus. And this isn't one of the good fungus. There's good fungus, like the mushrooms we eat. Um, penicillin is actually created by a fungus. This is a bad this fungus. Is not the one you want. Yeah, yeah, that's not the one you want. <laughs> this gets in between your toes, and it causes itchiness, scaliness, um, cracking, and it's just irritating. Right. And because it's a fungus, as you can imagine, like any virus or bacteria, it's contagious. Yeah. So you can catch it just from walking barefoot in the locker room, for example. For those of you out there who work out, wear flip-flops in the locker room. Right. You can catch it walking barefoot at home even. Really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. if someone so has it and it's, it's on contagious. the carpet. Yeah, it's yeah. very contagious. So the main thing is knowing it's a fungus, remembering it's contagious, right. and, and doing what you can to prevent yourself, it. Right? Yeah. yeah. And so what are some things you can do? So I brought a gym shoe here. Yep. So you work out and you have a stinky, stinky, sweaty gym shoe. Right. <laughs> so your sock is probably also stinky and sweaty. Yep. So what are you gonna do? You have to work out and you should switch your sock. Hmm. That's, if you don't, that mold, that sweaty sock is brewing the fungus and it's mm. on your feet. It's like working out and not changing your underwear. Right. Mm. Not good. Yeah, not good. Do that. So, so take an extra pair, I mean, especially if you know you're going to be walking around after. Exactly. Not go change right away. Change those socks. Change those socks right away. Um, you can use powder to keep it dry. Have clothing that's not too tight that airs out a bit. It breathes. Right. And um, if you are unfortunate and you get this, again, remember it's contagious. You know, towels, yeah. things like that, keep them separate from other people. And uh, the treatment's pretty easy. It's over the counter. You can just get one of these generic, you know, Clotrimazole or other creams over the counter. It comes in a little tube like this, and you put it on your feet. But it's not just the medicine, it's also these hygiene practices that we yeah. talked about. Absolutely. And, and, and knowing if you do have it uh, to protect everyone else around you. Right. Because that's how it spreads. Right. All right. And that's if you gross. get it again, you can get it again, too. So just because you've treated it once doesn't mean you won't right. get it again. So these are just good habits to get into. Absolutely. Protect right. yourself. Good. All right, Dr. Bose, thank you so much right. for joining us. Thank and you. if you have any questions at home, like this one you want submitted or you want to answer here on the front page, go ahead and submit them to the email there on your screen. We'll be right back. Stay with us.